chance to check out stats for Harrison Barnes. And he's taken a small step back offensively. He really hasn't been the same this month as he was earlier on. He's lacking the intensity he had. He needs a new mindset and stop being passive and play with more aggressiveness. Now let's take a look at the Kings opening lineup. Fox and Halliburton are the guard set. Barnes and Bagley in it forward together. And it's Jones in at the five, roaming the paint. And for Los Angeles, LeBron James out there with Trevor Ariza. Then there's Avery Bradley. Then it's Malik Monk. And it's Westbrook in at the one. Bradley, that's good. And these teams both look to push the tempo and transition. Brent, what's the most underrated component of success with that style of play? you got to have rebounders, B.A., guys who are willing to go in there. And if those guys who are gathering anything coming off the rim have the ability to bust out with the dribble, man, that gets your pace going. Westbrook against Fox. Pass to Bradley. Takes a three. And it's Sacramento with the rebound. They're coming off that win against the Heat. And in that one, the bench came to play. Gave the team a bunch of points and energy to put them over the top. Well, I talked to the assistant coaching staff. What they were stoked about is that the bench guys came in and played well. So punch off the bench, a big factor in that win. Four on the clock. Bagley for three. On target from range. That's a pretty easy opportunity for a teammate all courtesy of Harrison Barnes. Here in the first, a little over a minute played so far. Pass to Bradley. Now Monk. James with the ball. The Lakers got to get one up. Late clock. Here's Bradley. That three off target. Had some space there after the pump fake. Halliburton with the ball. Now guarded by Monk. Halliburton, the pass to Bagley. Inside. Here's Fox. Oh, Westbrook with the block. And Russell just bringing it right now on defense. Pass to James. Here's Bradley. Now Monk. Against Minnesota, he was really on his game. The ball's knocked loose. It's stolen by Fox. Now the Kings in transition. And they're going to count that bucket, and they'll send him to the line. It could be a three-point play. Pretty focused play right there from Harrison Barnes, showing he has what it takes to convert sometimes those challenging buckets like that one there. Los Angeles has gone one for three from outside so far in this game. Pass to James. Over Jones. Shots good by James. And LeBron has the skill and the green light to just get everything off anytime he wants. That time from the mid range. Now here's Jones. Back to Bagley. Westbrook against Fox. James with the block. Well, we've seen some big time blocks from LeBron James. Add that one to his reel. Over to the left wing. The shot from 20 feet out. Westbrook gets the bucket. For Sacramento, they've gone three of five shooting so far. Pass to Jones. Now Fox. Back to Jones. To the middle. Just five on the clock. Here's Bagley. That one drops for him. Bagley's got five now. Bagley getting positioned just too deep there and does a nice job with it. Just over three and a half minutes gone here in the first. Westbrook outside. And there's James from the arc. And it's Sacramento with the rebound. Fox, the pass to Halliburton. Now 
Outside Barnes. Bagley is screen on Westbrook. Left side Jones. Shot clock at six. Offline with a three. Well, the D really getting away with one there. No one on him. And that's going to be good nine out of ten times. Out to the right wing. Here's Bradley. He's covered by Bagley. I love great defense. Just quick to establish his feet, and he takes the hit. An outstanding defensive play to earn the mobile one block. And that kind of rejection early on energizes your squad. The coaching staff just loves this kind of hustle. It's Barnes on the wing. Pass to Jones. Puts it up from 12. And that one's good. A nice job on the glass as they picked up two on the second effort. That's a testament to the effort there on the boards. Never willing to give up on the possession. Finding ways to sniff out the ball. Here's Bradley. Coming in off a 14-point game last time out. Just five to shoot. Here's Westbrook. The Lakers with another miss. I admire the play call. They just couldn't capitalize. Yeah, an efficient offensive possession. They found the look that they wanted, just didn't go in. Now here's Fox. What a tremendous game he played against Miami. Oh, Westbrook with the block. James against Fox. James passes to Monk. The Lakers with another miss. And it's Sacramento's ball. They're on a 12-4 run. And Russell Westbrook on the move once again. This time to the Lakers. Now, what's interesting, I mean, he played so long for the OKC Thunder. And now on his fourth team in the past four years. But still, you can't deny the impact when he's on the floor. Now here's Westbrook. His last outing, he had 20. Over Fox. Ooh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. It's on De'Aaron Fox. It's so subtle, but what an effective up fake from Westbrook there. The defender couldn't help but take a bite. Shooting two. That free throw misses. Well, Brad, you were a master of meshing with your teammates. How key is being on the same page early in the year? Oh, it's so important, especially early in the season. Teams that can come together and mesh as a core have a great advantage at the start of the season. Anthony's checked in for the Lakers. Horton Tucker comes in for Bradley. And he sinks the second. And Westbrook, one of those guys in interviews that doesn't suffer fools, doesn't have a lot of time for the silliness, but on the floor he's about competing and getting after it, and that's why his team succeed. Now here's Fox. And that's going to be a travel. And the 2K leaderboard showing us the assist leaders over the last month. Fifth is Tyrese Halliburton. His teammates trust that if they get open, he will find them. They're really in a groove right now. The Lakers trail. Anthony, left side. To the paint. And the layup is good off the glass. Carmelo really has great footwork down low, showing off the feel right there when he gets near the paint. Halliburton, a screen on Westbrook. Fox against Westbrook. Out to heel for three. Knocks it down from distance. And that's what they want to do. Get him open looks early. Pass to Monk. Anthony in the post. He's guarded by Barnes. Anthony misses. For Sacramento, they've got half their attempts to go. Six of 12. Halliburton against Monk. Here's Barnes. It's stolen by James. Down low. Anthony outside. Westbrook outside. Oh, from deep. The shot, no good. 
So Sacramento will take it the other way. Jones up top. Outside Barnes. Pass to heel. And here's Halliburton. And there's the whistle. The illegal screen is the call. And they just keep making mistakes. I mean, that's back to back. turnovers which easily could have been prevented both teams deciding to change it up Los Angeles has gone just one of six from the three-point line so far here's James and it's James with the jam no, there's no stopping LeBron right there he's done that thousands of times all right a look at how the points have been generated so far a scoring breakdown for the Kings Hey, guys, they're passing the ball very efficiently here in the first half. They've also racked Mind up a ton of points Mind off of turnovers so far One in tonight's shot. game. So the Kings making a change here. Harkless has checked in. Way back in 2003, a guy named LeBron James was drafted first overall, and some predicted that he'd become the best player on the planet. But I don't think people could imagine he'd be doing it for this long now here's Mitchell he picked up 12 points in their last win against Miami healed from outside James with the rebound I love how they've attacked the boards here in the first quarter here's Reeves pass to James from nine feet and it's all tied up James has got seven points in the game. Sacramento has gone two of four from distance to begin this one. Here's Lynn. And out of bounds. Los Angeles will have it. The Lakers have gone 6 of 13 so far in this one. Pass to Reeves. Gordon Tucker on the wing. Got a piece of it. Here's Heald. James with the rebound. And the Lakers shooting the rock around 46% so far. Half to the outside. from beyond the arc. Lamelo cashing in right now from the perimeter where he's in transition and spotting up. You got to get to him. There's a screen. Pass to heel. Rejected by James. Westbrook, the pass to James. Steps back and fires. He's off on that one. So Sacramento will take it the other way. Here's Lynn. Pounded by Westbrook. We've got 155 left to play in the first quarter. Doing a lot of nice work now from the field. He's helped get them this lead, and now he's helped them keep it. The Kings trailing. Timeout call. Sacramento. And the other team is running all over them right now the timeout before the timeout here maybe just to cut off the momentum and have a chit chat with the team to settle down
The Kings making a switch here. Halliburton has checked in. And there's a minute 45 left in the first quarter. Back to Mitchell. And Russell Westbrook gets the whistle that time. That's his first foul. And just wasn't able to set up in time. Right side, heel. That one falls. Heel's got his second basket on the night. A good job in the mid range, Buddy Heel getting squared up and scores. Mitchell against Westbrook. Pass to James. Block! Out of bounds as Los Angeles keeps possession. Westbrook against Mitchell. Pass to Horton Tucker. Called in by the Kings. Well, he wants that one over again. I guarantee that. Nobody's even in the neighborhood. Now here's Heal. He's closely guarded. Here's Lynn. Right wing. Back to Mitchell. Six on the shot clock. Over James. A oh, nice shot by Mitchell. There's 38 seconds left to play in the first. Here's Westbrook. The shot goes down. Very quick possession right there. Westbrook's got five now. Well, the whole floor, including the mid-range, is Russell Westbrook's playground right now. Outside heel. And Reeves pulls it down. He's been off this whole period unable to sustain any kind of consistency and here's Westbrook Anthony with a screen on Mitchell and so it's LeBron James making things happen for the Los Angeles Lakers hunting for opportunities leading to nine points in the quarter more 2k action in just a moment And you think about LeBron James, not just one of the all-time greats. He's really a coach on the floor. I have the freedom to call sets, you know, whatever I feel best suit our team. I'm a smart, cerebral basketball player. Um, my basketball IQ is very high, and I take that very seriously. So I know what best suits our team, and our coaching staff does as well. He really does process the game at such a high level, Grant. Yeah, an all-time level. And he'll let you know about it. I mean, no false modesty at all. Says, I got this. Man, this has been a fairly close game through the first quarter. We'll see what happens here in the second. And a breakdown here, guys. The hustle stats for Los Angeles. Well, in their first half of play, they're closing out aggressively. The block shots, a key indicator of their activity defensively. They've also racked up a ton of points off of turnovers so far in tonight's game. And so in the game for the Kings, Fox and Halliburton are the guard set. Marvin Bagley is out there with Chemezi Metu. And it's Heal in at the small forward position. Now here's Bagley. He's got five. Outside Heal. Pass to Metu. Over James. Shots good by Metu. Second quarter, and we're just over a minute in. Here's Reeves, defended by Halliburton. J. 
James with the ball. A 26-point game for him and the win against Minnesota. Yeah, but all around offensively, the performance was great. He knew when he had it going, but he also knew he could get other guys going. So his passing right up there on the level with his scoring in that one. They now take the lead. Fox has got his first basket of the night. How about that? Just accepting the contact and still getting the finish for Fox. The Lakers trail. Aaron Fox just continues in the offseason, B.A., to explore where it is he can get just a little bit better. And that's going to be tough on defenses this season. Now here's Monk. Now quiet so far offensively, searching for his first points of the game. Healed on the wing. Pass to Metu. Can't cash it in from close range. For Los Angeles, they've gone just one of three to begin the second quarter. Anthony with it. He's covered by Bagley. Here's Reeves. There's the triple. Sacramento grabs the miss. Fox has got a rebound number five here tonight. And the improvement we've seen from Fox, it's across the board, Brent. It's not just about scoring. And that's the kind of growth that you like to see. So playmaking, a little bit more defense. And then I think for this ball club, looking for a leader. And De'Aaron Fox would love to be that. Now, here is James. He's got 11. Pass to Monk. Clock at six. And there's the foul. It's on Malik Monk. That's foul number two for him. And just a great job of getting there first and absorbing the contact. The Lakers making a switch here. Ariza's checked in. Jones, he's checked in for the Kings. Barnes comes in for Halliburton. And it's Sacramento's ball. They're on a 10-2 run here. Here's Fox. And once again, off the mark by Sacramento. D giving him that shot, and that's probably not a good idea, but I guess they knew what they were doing that time. And again, the Lakers, no good. Sacramento has gone four of six from three-point range thus far. Field passes to Fox. Just under three and a half minutes played here in the second quarter. And he gets it to go. Now two of six in the game. And their offensive execution has really picked up here in the second period. Los Angeles has gone 0 for 3 from deep to begin the second. Pass to Anthony. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. It's on De'Aaron Fox. Yeah, you can't fall for that kind of shot fake if you're the defender. Mello selling it well and then finds his way to the free throw line. Shooting two. The free throw drops for Anthony. Well, you hear about the importance of confidence. You think that was something you always had as a player, Grant, or did you have to build that up? Well, I mean, success ultimately does breed confidence, and I had success, fortunately, at a young age. So you have to understand you have to always attack, and you always have to believe in yourself no matter what the situation. And Anthony drops them both. Now you can tell he's feeling confident right now at the line, and when he's on, he can be lights out. Now here's Fox. Have the space there, but it's offline. Now his shooting has been a little bit below par. You think about what this lead would look like if he was on. And there's the screen from behind the arc. And the shot by Reeves, no good. The Kings have gotten five of seven shots to fall in the second. To the left wing. Fox outside. Bagley sets the screen. Six to shoot. The pass to heel. Late clock here. The Kings need to get one up. And there's Fox on the assist from Bagley. Fox has got seven now in this quarter. <laughs> I just love the ball movement. Here's Reeves. Guarded by heel. Pass to Bradley. There's a screen by Anthony. Bradley with a drive. Jones with the block. 
Heald from outside. And De'Aaron Fox picks up the foul. That's his third foul of the game. Los Angeles has gone 0 for 4 from beyond the arc here in the second quarter. Pass to Bradley. Here's Reeves, guarded by Heald. 13 feet out, and he hits the jump shot. Easy look when the defender isn't fighting over the screen. Yeah, the coach over there just asking for one simple thing, and that's some effort. Got burned on that one. Now here's Bagley. Five points in the game. Barnes, no good. It's tough to get open in this league, and when you do, it hurts not to capitalize. Anthony misses. And it's Sacramento's ball. They're on a 15-6 run. Back to Fox. Pass to Jones. Knocks it loose. Here's Reeves. Guarded by Heal. Here's Ariza. Over to the wing. And the shot goes in. How about the experience paying off here as Ariza excellent at noticing that his man was wide open. Sacramento has gotten five of their nine attempts from deep to go. The three from Barnes. Gets the three to fall. Barnes has got six. When you let a team knock down that many threes, you know you're likely to be on the wrong side of a run. Here's Reeves. Anthony with a screen on heel. Pass to Ariza. And here's Monk. He's guarded by Barnes. Out to Anthony. Five to shoot. Here's Reeves. And he takes it in for the layup off a very nice feed. Melo good at scanning the entire floor, and that's why at that time he found the open teaming. Here's Fox. He's got seven. Outside heel. The three is up. The basket's good off the assist from Fox. Heald's got nine points in the quarter. Man, they're having a hard time defending the triple. That's three in a row. Pass to Bradley. Monk with it. Three-pointer. Drops in the three. Oh, you got to love the back and forth. Showing real confidence at the arc. With both teams finding ways to the three-point line and trying to take advantage from distance. Now here's Heald. 26 points for him, last game against Miami. Pass to Anthony, and the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. It'll be on Marvin Bagley. Melo powering his way through the defense down there. He's used to that kind of contact throughout his career. Shooting two. First free throw is good. Just get a feeling like Melo has brought some extra energy to this one. This guy eats, drinks, and breathes basketball, but he's at it here tonight. Horton Tucker, he's checked in for the Lakers. Russell Westbrook comes in for Bradley. And Anthony drops them both. Well, his body control is phenomenal, and his ability to get to the line has always been impressive. That's a huge part of his game. Pass to Lynn. There's a whistle. That goes on Carmelo Anthony. That's his first foul of the game. Lakers on D. Now here's Barnes. Shot clock at six. Uh, good defensive instincts there from Melo reaching out and altering that shot. Pass to Horton Tucker. 
And he lobs it up and finished off by Westbrook. Yeah, how many times have we seen Westbrook way up like that with the poster shot? He's just doing what simply other people cannot. Westbrook against Mitchell. And here's Barnes. Oh, the offensive struggle. Continue missing again. Westbrook, the pass to Anthony, and the foul called on Harrison Barnes. That's foul number two for him. That's a foul he wanted to avoid, and he definitely doesn't want to pick up his third before the half. James is checked in for Ariza, and the Kings also making a change. Halliburton is checked in. On defense, the Kings. Pass to Monk. The shot's good. Monk's got his second bucket on the night. Credit their discipline. They've been working for high percentage shots. For Sacramento, they've gotten half their shots to fall in the second. Eight for 16. Halliburton, the pass to Thompson. Healed on the wing. Fires the three. It's good. He's six for 12 from the floor. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. They should continue to ride the hot hand. It's Monk on the wing. Here's James. Gets it. He's 6 for 10 and looking confident out there. We've seen that more than once today. An effortless basket inside. Thompson with a screen. The three from Mitchell. And the Kings with another three. 12 straight points off threes. This defense is not extending very well. Pass to Anthony. James, a screen on Thompson. The Kings leading. Now Mitchell. He's got five. Here's Lynn. Outside heel. Clock at six. Let's go with a three. Kept alive. Thompson finds Halliburton. The basket's good. Off the assist from Thompson. Thompson with a nice job finding the open man. Creating for his teammate. And we've got 118 left in the first half of this one. Westbrook, the pass to James. Pulls up at the elbow. Thompson pulls it in. Probably not the shot that was drawn up for that possession, but you can't pass it up and you can't knock it down. Halliburton against Monk. Halliburton outside. That went off the back iron and out. Los Angeles has gone just one of six from distance during the second quarter. It's Monk on the wing. Back to Anthony. To the inside. Deflects the pass. Thompson with a steal. Pass to Halliburton. Outside Mitchell. Great D that time from Monk. The Lakers trail. Westbrook outside. With the drive. Off the mark and the drought continues. A lot of defenders choose to just back up off of him when he's in that tight. Try to avoid the and one and this time they're not backing off. And we finished off one half of play. The Kings on top. They lead by six. And join us right back here after the break for the start of the second half. And thank you for joining us as with two quarters in the book, looking good for the Sacramento Kings.
They've been knocking it down from three. You have to give the playmakers credit for consistently finding the open guy. And then, of course, their shooters have delivered. If they keep it up, they're going to be tough to beat. All right, and now let's get to this first half and talk about the players who are leading their respective teams. If you could have drawn up an ideal scenario for this game, this would be it. The big dogs trying to one-up each other, neither giving an inch. Everyone in the building and watching at home must be eating this up. You know I am. Appreciate you joining us. It's been our distinct pleasure, and I mean that. Let's now take you back over to the third quarter with Brian Anderson. And after a fairly even first couple of quarters, this second half could turn out to be a great one as both teams trying to gain an edge. Boy, Buddy Heald displaying all his skills today. Through the first two quarters and change, his perimeter shooting continues to be spot on. Yeah, you would hope the defense at least would start to consider creeping up on him just a little bit. Second half of basketball is upon us, and we may be in for an exciting finish based on how close of a game we've seen so far. Russell Westbrook out there with Avery Bradley. Then it's Malik Monk. Then there's LeBron James. And it's Ariza in at the four. That's who's in the game for the Lakers. Now here's Fox. Seven points in the game. Here's Halliburton. The basket's good off the assist from Fox. Fox has got his third assist of the night. That's been typical of their performance today. They're sharing the ball and creating good shots. Now Los Angeles with it. Trailing by eight. They host the Hawks after this one. And they're deep into this homestand. That'll be game four out of five. Westbrook against Fox. Shoots a fadeaway. And the shot goes down. Westbrook's got nine. They have no answer defensively inside. Fox, the pass to Bagley. Outside for Halliburton. Pass to Barnes. Back to Halliburton. Six on the shot clock. Let's a floater go. Outside Barnes. Now Halliburton. And that one's on target from the wing. Halliburton's got four points now in the quarter. Oh, what a crafty move, causing the defender to pause right there. Well, we hear about NBA players whose dads played in the league or overseas. But for Tyrese Halliburton, his father, John, was a referee. I mean, that man, Tyrese, was exposed to the game at such a young age. His father, John, took him to basketball camp starting in preschool. And when you watch how Tyrese plays, it's obvious he has a great feel for the game. And the tally just keeps going up for LeBron James and his career scoring total. Another night, third all-time now, along with Carl Malone and Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. Halliburton outside. Fox against Westbrook. Outside Bagley. A shot from the high post. Rebounded by LeBron. James has got four rebounds now. A little under two and a half minutes gone by in the third quarter. Westbrook outside. Over Jones. Monk for three. And that one comes off the assist by Westbrook. Westbrook's got three assists now in this one. And just sinks it over the tall defender. That's why you have to crowd shooters on the perimeter. Yeah, that effort just not good enough because even if that defender was a bit taller, the shooter already locked in.
A chance now to show you the best three-point threat to shooting guard over the past month. Second is Tyrese Halliburton. These long-range shooters almost always have the green light because uh, they're just so accurate. Well, they're not players who run hot and cold. It's just hot when they're behind the arc. And if any of them do suffer from a cold stretch, it never lasts long. Shoot yourself in, then shoot yourself out. Monk against Barnes. Ooh, took him no time at all to get that one. Barnes has got his third basket on the night right there. Now Barnes likes to do his damage around that area, fluid in the mid-range. Fires for three. And it's Sacramento with the rebound. Fox has got seven rebounds in the game. <laughs> the battle of the boards has been something to watch. Drops in the layup for two. Now it's a seven-point Kings lead. Well, trying to figure out ways to score through contact, De'Aaron Fox does not back down. Third quarter action. Just under three and a half minutes have passed. Pass to James. And the foul on Tyrese Halliburton. That's his first foul of the game. How about that strong defensive performance for this half's mobile one block? Yeah, good offense comes from great defense. This lead is only getting stronger with plays like that. Here's Monk. Now here's Westbrook. He's covered by Fox. No good on the triple. For Sacramento, they've gotten four of seven shots to drop in the third. Bagley is screen on Monk. Fox the pass to Bagley. And the officials will call the illegal screen here. And now a look at the upcoming schedule for the Los Angeles Lakers. On Friday, they'll be playing against Clint Capella and the Atlanta Hawks. Then on Sunday, they'll be matching up against Steven Adams and the Memphis Grizzlies. Pass to Bradley. Now, here is James. Defense right on him. Now, here's Westbrook. Five on the clock. Outside Monk. Let's it go from deep. And it's Sacramento with the rebound. Bagley passes to Fox. Jones with the ball. Ariza's there. Fox finds Halliburton. Fox up top. Pounded by Westbrook. It's good. Fox has got 11. Things are starting to come together for them. And the lead is starting to grow, too. Coaches always talk about the first five minutes of the third quarter. They have definitely increased their energy level here. Trying to find a spark here. Yes, indeed. A rough stretch offensively. They could really use a basket. Bradley misses. I know he's on a cold streak, but he can't let that get in his head. Especially if you're a player that doesn't get a lot of shot attempts. But otherwise, the mindset is, I just got to get the next one to go. And you don't want to put that much pressure on yourself. From the strike, Barnes, no good. He may not be the strongest inside presence in the league, but still, he's got to convert from there. To the right side. Here's Westbrook. It's stolen by Fox. From 18 feet away, and Bagley gets it to go on the assist from Halliburton. And now an 11 point Sacramento lead. Pass to Bradley. Over Fox. Oh, steps back and drains the jumper. Bradley's got his second basket of the night. That's a nice shot from the mid range. The defense can't let Bradley get that kind of rhythm on that kind of shot. For Sacramento, they've gotten six of ten shots to fall in this third quarter. Timeout call, Sacramento. Let's give Coach credit. He's trying to find a way to squeeze the most out of every possession. Got to feel good as a coach if you make all those adjustments. Pull the right strings. That's what they love to do.
Metu, he's checked in for the Kings. Out to the wing. Halliburton outside. Outside Barnes. Takes the three. And Reeves pulls it down. Los Angeles is gone. One of six from three-point range here in the third. Not the result they're looking for. And you love how LeBron is able to lift the whole team with his passing. That facilitating gives them a lot of energy. The Kings leading. To Halliburton. Open shot, Barnes. That's good. And Halliburton gets the assist. Halliburton's got his fifth assist in this one. James outside. Four three. Ariza can't get it to go. For Sacramento, they've gotten seven of twelve shots to drop in the third. Here's Metu. Fox outside. Pass to Halliburton. Jacks up a three. Can't hit that one. And Los Angeles the other way now. Tyrese Halliburton opened some eyes in his first season and the way that he played. I mean, just has such a headiness about him. Ended up being the 12th pick in the draft. Here's James. Oh, what a finish in traffic. My goodness. Now LeBron sometimes will show him off. The handle's right there. Pretty sick. Slicing up the defense that time. Sacramento has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the third. Fox against Westbrook. Jones. Oh, and there's a one-hand jam. And you have to prevent him from getting to the paint, uh, unless you want to see a highlight. The Lakers trail. And Halliburton has had an outstanding rookie season, Brent. Well, it's his skill set, B.A., that I think is something that you just got to admire. He plays the game with great pace. He sees the next play before it happens. And then his willingness to step up in big moments. That's been huge. Anthony's checked in for the Lakers. Gordon Tucker on the wing. Guarded by Heald. Oh, love the intensity in which they're hitting the boards. There's a screen by Metu. From seven feet away, healed with the bucket. Getting it done inside. And now a 10-point Sacramento lead. Westbrook outside. They set a pick. Driving inside. And count the basket. He was fouled. And he's going to the line for one more. And let's take a moment here to get your take, guys, on the scoring so far for the Kings. They keep piling on the assists, guys. They haven't cooled off any in that regard. And it's a feel-good night from behind the three-point line, racking up a ton of threes. Here's Mitchell. He's got five. Timeout called. Sacramento.
And while we have a pause in the action, let's take a look at the premier ball thieves at the shooting guard position over the last month. Fifth is Tyrese Halliburton. The overall quickness of these guys is just flat out incredible. I mean, quick feet, quick hands. <laughs> That's why they're effective perimeter defenders. Well, if he was a light switch, he'd always be on. Defensively, they treat each possession like the game depends on it. They're looking to cause a little bit of chaos in any way that they can. And so here's Sacramento. They've led by as many as 11. Mitchell against Anthony. And it's Mitchell penetrating. Anthony grabs the board. Anthony's got his fifth rebound in this one. James passes to Anthony. Westbrook against Mitchell. James, a screen on Mitchell. There's the drive. And Westbrook slams it home. Westbrook examining the defense, sees the crack, and explodes right through it. And Sacramento has possession. It's a five-point game. Westbrook against Mitchell. The baseline, Jay. Drained it for two points. Mitchell's got seven points in the game. The Lakers have gone eight of 15 in the third quarter. Pass to James. Anthony outside. The three ball. No good that time. So Sacramento will take it the other way. Heald passes to Mitchell. Here's Metu. Here's Halliburton. He's got seven. Heald from outside. That's good. And Halliburton gets the assist. Halliburton's got his sixth assist of the night. And here's James. Here's Anthony. And Anthony slams it in. Oh, Mello getting up and slamming one home. Outside heel. Let's the three fly. And they recover it. Here's Lynn. And he goes in for the dunk. And he's battling for everything. Doing all he can to help extend their lead. <laughs> Just throwing down the putback with authority. Now, the team's having a tough time containing him. Attacking all the way there. So it's the Lakers now. After the Kings picked up the basket a moment ago. Great awareness from LBJ. Great at slashing off the ball. Open space available. He filled it. A minute 39 left to play in the third quarter. Outside Mitchell. He shoots. And it's Heald. That time on the assist by Mitchell. Heald's got 24 points. And if they're going to make a move, this is a good time to start. And, and there's still plenty of time, but they definitely don't want to let this game get too far out of hand. Now here's Anthony. He's got 13. Anthony with a screen on Halliburton. Out to James. Mitchell up top. Pass to Metu. Healed on the wing. Beyond the arc. Rebound, the Lakers. Anthony outside. Fires in the triple. Westbrook quick to find the open man that time. There's 48 seconds left in the third. Halliburton, a screen on Westbrook. Here's Mitchell. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. The defense there doing whatever they can to protect the rim. Shooting two. And the first one at the line is good. He's perfect from the line this time. The Lakers trail. Gordon Tucker on the wing. Westbrook against Mitchell. And finished off by Westbrook. 
Look, I know some guys are going to dunk, but when it's Westbrook, man, he fires up his teammates. And so here's Sacramento. They've led by as many as 11. And here's Heald. 12 seconds left in the third quarter here. Shot clock at five. Let's it fly. Set it up with a fake, but it's offline. Well, he finds some space in that in-between gap there. Too bad he can't release that one on target. And so it's the Sacramento Kings closing out this quarter with a seven-point lead. And it's all due to their ability to own the paint. They've been dominant down low. We're coming right back. Don't go anywhere. And it's time to bring up the State Farm assist to the game. You know, I'm kind of stoked that this was a choice because I love this pass. A remarkable find. He put his court vision on full display. Well, a great job with the eyes. And what separates great playmakers, as we know, is peripheral vision. And this is it. Glad to have you along for this fourth quarter. Taking a look at the Kings. Fox and Halliburton are the guard set. Marvin Bagley is out there with Buddy Heald. And it's Jones in at the five. And that'll be Los Angeles ball as it goes out of bounds. Lakers able to keep the possession. Kings on D. They lead by seven. And there's James from the arc. Over Jones, three-pointer, Anthony, that falls. Nice feed that time from James. James has got three assists in the game. Pass to Jones. Healed from outside. James with the rebound. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three-point line. And Anthony slams it in. Catching and firing Melo has it all working in this one. The Kings shooting a nice 50% for the game. Jones up top. Halliburton right side. The three is up. Hits the three-pointer. And defensively, how do you leave them that open in crunch time? About one minute played here in the fourth quarter. Westbrook against Fox. Pass to Monk. And the foul called on Buddy Heal. That's his first foul of the game. Now the D has done a very poor job at contesting him from outside, guys. He's tearing into them right now, and they cannot stop him. Barnes, he's checked in for heel. And that one misses. you got to love how they've been crashing the boards, fighting hard for every miss. Pass to Fox. To the middle. Right side, Jones. Good on the shot. And the Kings lead by four. It's winning time, and that's a winning play. Westbrook finds James. Launches a three. And Anthony gets it to go on the assist from James. James has got four assists now tonight. Back to Fox. Last quarter of play, about two minutes in now. Pass to Barnes. He drains it. Made half his shots. He's five for ten now. Attacking is one thing, but body control... Another, and Harrison Barnes showing you that on that play. The Lakers have gotten four or five attempts to fall so far in the fourth. Here's Monk. Here's Bradley. Six to shoot. 
Pass to Anthony. To tie it up. And it's Sacramento with the rebound. Barnes has got his sixth rebound on the night. Jones up top. It's going to be on LeBron James. That's foul number two for him. Tough break for the defense. I mean, he took the hit, but he didn't get the call. Ariza's has checked in for LeBron. A little over two and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth. They're finally taking care of the ball and playing smarter. Turnovers were a problem early on. Los Angeles has gotten three threes to fall out of four attempts here in the fourth. Pass to Bradley. To the paint. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. It's on De'Aaron Fox. Yeah, there's sometimes games where Westbrook takes personal challenges at the big guys. Two. Two. The first one falls. So Westbrook nails both of them. The Kings have gone three of four in the fourth and looking confident on offense. Halliburton on the wing. Launches it. Anthony grabs the board. Anthony's got rebound number seven tonight. Pass to Ariza. Barnes against Monk. Down to five on the shot clock. Westbrook with the miss. Sacramento has gotten one of three to fall from downtown here in the fourth. Well, Fox with the eyes and ears up that time. Good vision to facilitate. The Lakers trail. Westbrook outside. Here's Bradley, defended by Halliburton. Monk, he's open. That one a little long. For Sacramento, they've gotten four shots out of six attempts to drop so far in the fourth. It's Barnes on the wing. Pass to Jones. Hey, now five for eight, shooting a pretty good percentage right now. Defensively, they've got to get more bodies in the paint. That's three straight field goals from below the free throw line. Los Angeles has gone three for five from three-point land since the end of the third quarter. Now here's Anthony. There's the three. Barnes with the rebound. Barnes has got seven rebounds in the game. Fox outside. Pass to Barnes. The basket's good off the assist from Fox. Barnes has got 10 points in just the second half. Westbrook with it. Here's Bradley, defended by Halliburton. Back to Westbrook. The Lakers with another miss. The Kings have gotten six of eight shots to fall during this fourth. Down low. Out to Bagley. They set the pick. Shot clock at six. And there's the basket. And the whistle blows. Chance at a three-point play here. Going to the line for one. One shot. The 
NBA has a major presence in Africa now, and you were a big part of making that happen, Grant. Yeah, no, it's very exciting. And to work with the NBA and strategic investors over on the continent in Africa, it's not just a great investment, but you're also doing the right thing, spreading the game, sharing the game, and giving people on the continent the joy that basketball brings to everyone. And keeping us updated from the sideline, Allie LaForce. I was able to listen in on what Frank Vogel told the team earlier. He let his guys know that he needs more from them to close this deficit. He said, quote, we have to get something started. I know we're behind, but you are capable of taking this game if you still want it. All right, appreciate it, Allie. to Westbrook. Outside Monk. Back to Westbrook. Westbrook drawing the double. Just five to shoot. Here's Ariza. Monk for three. And again, no good by the Lakers. They really have a commanding lead, not just in points, but in rebounds as well. Bagley with it. Bradley on him. Bagley, no good. Yeah, I have no idea why he went with the fadeaway there. The defense was nowhere near him, and he should have just kept it simple. Pass to Ariza. On the wing, Bradley. He's covered by Fox. The Lakers with another miss. He lacks defense there. He's going to see fewer and fewer chances if he can't bury those kind of jumpers. Side Monk. Pass to Anthony. Spins. Over Jones. Anthony misses. The Kings have gotten seven of their first ten shots to go during this fourth quarter. The three from Barnes. Rebound the Lakers. Offensively, it's been a struggle for them. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. Knocked away. It's stolen by Halliburton. Kicks it out to Barnes. Fox against Westbrook. Pass to Jones. Over Anthony. And it's off the back of the rim. No good. Los Angeles has gone three of seven from the perimeter during the fourth. Here's Ariza. Wing Bradley. Clock at six. Over Bagley. Poke loose. Well, the fact that he has that many rebounds for a guy of his size and stature shows you he truly cares about grabbing possessions off the rim. Attacking the rim with power. Tremendous finish. The Lakers really having a tough go here. Pass to Anthony. Back to Westbrook. Here's Bradley. A shot to stop the drill. And it's Sacramento with the rebound. Jones has got six rebounds in the game. 
And they're up considerably because of their efforts on the glass. And it's Fox penetrating. And that basket makes him 6 for 11, shooting a good percentage. Just Fox being impossible to contain right there on the drive. The Lakers shooting at 45% of the game so far. Pass to Anthony. And Anthony slams it in. A dynamic finish, then decides to hang out a little for good measure. <laughs> yep, that's the exclamation point right there. Outside Jones. Halliburton outside. Fox up top. There's a screen. Rejected by Westbrook. Monk against Barnes. Let's it go. And he didn't get quite enough under that one. Time for some consideration in the passing category, maybe, Kevin. The shot is just not on. Get somebody else going. Here's Jones. Rebounded by the Lakers. Westbrook's got his seventh rebound here tonight. Pass to Bradley. Ooh, good D by Bagley. Sacramento has gotten just one of their four threes to go here in the fourth quarter. The three from Barnes. Yes! And a nice assist from Fox. Fox has got assist number eight now on the night. Westbrook, the pass to Anthony. And he lays it up and in. Anthony's got 28 points for the game. Mello buries these kind of shots all the time. It seems like there's not a difficult shot in Mello's handbook. Here's Fox. No one on him. Makes an easy one. And just totally relentless. Only increasing the intensity level. Yeah, he's the guy that you want to go to right now trying to put this one away. Ariza sends it home from three-point land. Ariza rising and firing. 144 left in the final quarter. Sacramento has got two of five threes to go here in the fourth. Here's Fox. And Fox powers it home. It's like he's doing pull-ups on the rim. Looked like a schoolyard playground right there. There's a minute 34 left in the fourth quarter here. Westbrook against Fox. Goes up from the top of the key. No good. Off the front rim. And the King shooting it with confidence. 54% so far. Pass to Halliburton. Grant, as someone who played abroad on Team USA, how exciting is it to see how much more international the league has become? It's fantastic. No question. You know, back then we saw so many talented foreign stars playing internationally, but now the best really do all find their way here to the NBA. A minute four left to play in the fourth. They came out and had a statement win with their performance tonight. A fantastic effort to get it done here for the Kings. They made the most of the extra rebounds tonight. Helped them out a lot. You know, when you look at these teams, they're both great rebounding clubs. And any night, either one could have the advantage on the boards. And this one concludes with their second victory of the year. And while there were some guys out there that played well, what really stood out was the production for De'Aaron Fox. And guys, I just felt he was tremendous tonight. His energy infected his teammates and the wrecking ball on both ends. Westbrook outside. Pass to Monk. Here's Bradley from the arc. Knocks down the triple. These teams are finding the range, showing a lot of confidence. It seems like they're going to find out who can make the deepest threes. Right now it's a shootout. Now here's Fox. So it's the Kings winning this one easily. Exceptional effort on the road. They were ready and they were focused. All right, Allie, good stuff there. Thanks for that. And that'll wrap it up, folks. For Brent Berry, Grant Hill, and Allie LaForce, this is Brian Anderson. Thank you for watching this 2K Sports presentation of the NBA. And we'll see you next time.